Huh, Chris. <laughs> A-Hole Productions. Uh, what's up, Mysterion Gaming? Thank you for being here. Hope you're doing well tonight, sir. And uh, we are going to head over to this. Our mission activated. We have a pizza in the oven. And the guy said we could have it for free if we uh, post on social media that we got pizza from Eddie's. Um, so I guess I guess we'll do that at some point. Um, automatically, hopefully. But for now, I gotta go do this. Oh yeah, he'll mess me up. Good night. Uh, so, Mysterion, are you, uh... I know you probably heard the news by now about Stan Lee. Um, do you have any Stan Lee stories you want to share? Um, any comics of his that you that he wrote that you really loved? Did, have you read any comics written by Stan Lee? I know that's mostly for an older generation. I know he's done some stuff in the... Like, the 90s, I think he did, or early 2000s, I think he did, uh, like, Stanley Imagines the DC Universe, something like that. Um, I know he did, like, Fantastic Four, The Last Adventure or something. I think might have been in the mid-2000s as well. Thanks. Um, so I don't know, as for me, I mean, I, I always go back to, uh, you know, some of his early X-Men stuff. I definitely grew up an X-Men kid, but in, like, the late 80s, early 90s. But it made me go back and, like, you know, want to understand uh, the original stuff, especially later, like, when I got when I, became, when I was, like, 18 or 19. And I think I was 18 when the X-Men movie came out. And I was listening to an interview with Brian Singer about uh, how, you know, he always saw Professor X and Magneto as, like, Malcolm X and Martin Luther King Jr. And they had, like, different approaches to um, how they wanted to be a part of the world that didn't like them. And or didn't accept them, and I, that fascinated me so much that I actually started to go back and, you know, r do research on those two men, uh, but also um, read early Stan Lee comic books. And I think my favorite issue is probably issue 14, which is the first appearance of the Sentinels, and uh, I really love that issue. I actually owned it at one point. It was my oldest X-Men comic in my collection at one point, uh, issue 14. Um, but I had to sell it for, you know, pay bills and stuff. But uh, it was the first appearance of the Sentinels, and man, was it a cool issue. I love robots. I love giant robots, too. Um, but it was cool. It was neat to see this storyline where humanity's hatred, or at least a group of humanity's hatred, you know, grew so big that they would create giant robots to go kill, you know, other living beings. Um, it was just like this, you know, seemed like fantasy to me. Uh, but uh, giant robots are not too far away from from us. Um, what do I do if the kid looks like Peter? Stop, MJ, just stop. What? So we got a Mary Jane mission on the DLC. Okay. Um, so yeah, I mean, I always loved that issue. That one was a really great one. Um, I was also a big fan of his early uh, Silver Surfer stuff. If you ever read those, I think they were like in the later '60s. So Surfer number one was great. The one that kind of tells his origin like on uh, Zenla, um, I think is the name of his planet. And uh, of counterfeit kids. Looks like I thought that was a cool issue. Um, and then also, I think it was issue four or five, was um, was him versus Thor. Silver Surfer versus Thor. Slacking off. He was talking to you. 
Oh man, Mysterion, was it something I said? It's going to the distribution center. Mister Mysterion left. Oh, I'm sorry, bud. All right, I'll tell the boys. Hopefully you come back in. Uh oh. The family's causing trouble. Acting like they want to go to war. I gotta have it sit down. See what we do about this. We're on high alert. If you see anyone, don't take any chances. Take them out. Okay, we're on high alert. We've got all the shipping company data, which will hopefully tell us where they're keeping her son. I'll look through it later. But now, we've gotta get out of here. Quietly. Yeah, let's go quietly. What? So Hammerhead got shot in the head and lived? After that, you got the plate put in. Oh, that's how he got the metal plate in his head. Yeah, I guess I can't. Can't really tag either of those guys. Can I get out of here? Oh, phew, okay. I'm not very good at stealth missions, so I'm glad that one was a little easy. Hold oh. on. <laughs> I didn't recognize the hand at first because it's the different costume, but it does have the webbing on it. I just didn't see, I just saw the shimmery red. I was gathering evidence and trying to find a missing child. I ate as fast as I could. I've got stuff to follow up on. I'll call you later. Oh. oh. Note to self. No upside downies after double pepperoni. Thanks. <laughs> no upside downies. Oh, what? So what are we looking at? I didn't finish the side mission because it drove me right into uh, the black cat thing. Oh, man, I was doing like a side mission. And he drove me around the block right into Black Cat territory. Oh, well. My son's dead. Oh, yikes. I like the Scarlet Spider costume. Um, so, yeah, I bought the Scarlet Spider action figure for 20 bucks. I was like, I gotta have it. It's too cool. Um, I always love that costume. Come on. Please. Yeah, stop flirting for like two seconds. Oh. Dang. Whoa. The bartender. Get him. <laughs> He's got Molotov cocked. Oh, crap. I hate those Gatling gun guys. <laughs> I don't know. Oh crap! Please tell me Black Cat can take down that big guy with the Gatling gun, because those guys suck so bad. Does that not work on him? Guess not. Boom. Whew. Yeah, those guys, man. They're like, for me, they're like mini bosses. I saw other people getting frustrated with them too, but I know why I can't beat them. They're, <laughs> I'm not very good at the combat. So it makes sense to me why I can't beat them. Other people, I'm like, come on, you're younger. You should be able to do this. Oh, oh. What is she doing? Like, I thought she had a kid over here. Did you find the location of the vault? No. There's We're no kid, is that. there? I mean, I know there's no. I know Spider-Man's not the dad, but yeah, speaking of him, is there no kid at all? That would be really low of her. Do you ever miss this? What? Me getting shot at while you steal things? <laughs> I really tried going straight. Got a job that didn't involve breaking or entering. Even 
started wearing sweatpants on weekends. I wondered where you went. <laughs> it must have been hard for you. Especially with a child. Hmm. I need to go deeper. I'm gonna find him. Let me help. If we're supposed to be working together... Some things I do better alone. Something. Oh. I'll call you if I need an extra pair of hands. Oh good, I thought they were gonna do that. Like, <laughs> rainy upside down kiss. Whoo! McClinton sentence. Hey MJ, did you get any good info from that laptop? I'm still decrypting the data. We should have something soon. Alright, get on MJ. In the meantime, we need your help. We think Hammerhead's keeping her son in a vault. We don't know where the vault is. In a vault, like. Once I crack these files, maybe we can combine my chocolate with your peanut butter. Yo yo, uh, dead eye shots in the house. What's up, dude? Hard to resist a setup like that. How are you? How you been? Thanks, I saw that kid uh, give you a shout on uh, Twitter today. I guess you were hanging out in his stream. That was really nice of him. Um, well, thank you for hanging out in mine, my friend. What? Party must have stashed oh, here. that's what this is. Okay. I for I already forgot that we were looking for the um. Wow. There we go. Another painting. Boom. I forgot we were looking for these. Congratulations, detective. You might be the winner of some of Walter Hardy's stolen loot. Listen, no offense. But I've been looking into case files. Some witnesses say you and the new black cat were seen working together. What's up with that? She said she wanted to go straight and I believed her. <laughs> I tried to train her and she did a lot of good. For a while. Unfortunately, old habits die hard. I got a tip she was stealing from the crooks we took down. Went to her place and found the loot. You knew where she lived? Was this professional or uh, <laughs> was something else going on? Dude, you don't want to know. What was my theory on that guy? I, the Detective Mackey? Um, the way he's like... I don't know, the way he's kind of like... He seems kind of shady. <laughs> I feel like he's um he's the Black Cat's father. Uh, I don't know, I could be wrong. It's just a gut feeling on, of mine. Um, Dead Eye says, I hope they put something for Spider-Man to wear for Stan in the DLC. Oh, man. Like a True Believer t-shirt or something? Or an Excelsior t-shirt? Something like that? Alex is a good dude. Always nice. Is that the kid who gave you the shout-out? That's awesome. Um, what's his name or channel? Uh, first of all, if you're watching this later on YouTube, check out Dead Eye Shots um, on Twitch. And uh, Alex? What's Alex's uh, handle or, or Twitch link? Um, here's, your stuff. here's your professional. Hey, Kitty Money, what's up? Oh, sorry, got distracted by Kitty. <laughs> oh, now I gotta catch this car, guys. Nice. Um, but yeah, it was uh, Alex the Wizard. Is 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 Alex's channel? Okay. Alex the Wizard, cool, on Twitch. So if you guys are out there, look up Deadeye underscore Shots, Shots with a S-H-O-T-Z, and Alex the Wizard. Uh, check those guys out on Twitch. Oh, what the F? There we go. All right. Hello, kitty. Hello, kitty, indeed. Uh, thanks for popping in, Kitty. Thank you all for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, so yeah, hearing about stands, so I did. I, I my roommate told me, and I couldn't process it. And I went and got tires on my car, and then then that's when I was like, all right, I'm gonna go. I need to go to a comic book store. I I was like, I because someone was like, oh, you should make a video about what Stan meant to you. And I said, you know what? I'll just talk about it on a live stream, and we'll talk about some of my favorite comics that Stan wrote. I already mentioned X Men number fourteen, and I mentioned um, 
Silver Surfer number one, and I think number four, which had like a Silver Surfer versus Thor in it. Um, but I actually have a little bit of, I think I have a list here somewhere. Um, yeah, I think it was, well, I have, I mean, his Fantastic Four run with Jack Kirby is is my favorite stuff of, uh, of Stan Lee's. Um, I always love that stuff. This place is um, I could keep the kid here for but uh, Incredible Hulk, number one, that's a really good issue. Uh, Daredevil, number one, is a really good issue. Daredevil, I think it's number, is it eight? I want to say it's issue eight that the Stilt Man first appeared, but I really like that issue. If I'm going back to like the early Stan Lee stuff, um, Stilt Man is such a goofy character, but it, it was so fun to read that issue. If you've never read Daredevil number eight, I think you can buy it on Comixology. Uh, press. Oh, okay. Oh, shoot. A lot of guys guarding this place. This won't be easy. Oh, so she can help me. Okay, and I can help her. Okay, cool. Um... This guy up here. Nice one. We should team up more often. Oh, nice. Uh, I was at work and was like, this has to be fake, right? I kept seeing it everywhere and it, it hurt to see him pass. Yeah, you know, how many times, because I think there was like a fake article at one point saying he had passed um, like a couple years ago. And I was like, oh, come on. That was in bad port. It was someone like just trolling or something. Um, so I wasn't sure. You know, I was, uh, I wasn't sure about it. We gotta get that guy over there. Get all the snipers. Looks like about nine guys left. One per life. Let's not mess this up. <laughs> Good job. That's what I'm here for. Oh, um, then I get this guy so she doesn't get caught. Just a few left. Yeah, where are these guys at? got left two all right where are they at I knew he had fallen ill a few months or so ago as well he's been uh, he's been having trouble for I think a little while it was uh, you know Todd McFarlane actually visited him a couple times in the past few weeks I think Roy Thomas visited him recently too and Roy had like a really you know he said basically like Sam uh, that Stan was ready to go he was like he was like, look, Stan, Stan was ready to go. Um, and, uh, it was, it was hard for him, you know, those last few, whatever, like, you know, months and stuff. So come on, get this guy right here. Come on, cat, get him. Still using that technique. Get him. Boom. Whew. Can't believe we did that in one try. I normally suck at stuff like this. Um, but yeah, it, but it was the past couple weeks I've been watching, you know, different people. I think Kevin Smith reached out to him at one point. Um, and uh, I know Ty McFarlane visited him a few times. Roy Thomas, like I said. Um, yeah, it was... Uh, 
you get the claws. It was rough, but it was good to see people checking in on him. People that I knew knew without a shadow of a doubt cared about his well-being. Um, because you hear so many stories and you don't know. You know, it's like you don't know what about it, you know any of it. Like people go like, oh, this person is watching him and they're evil, and it's like you don't know for sure. You know, so uh, but I knew like just a bunch of boxes. You know, Todd keep looking. and those guys. You know, they I know they love Stan. He he did a lot for them. So. Um, Containers have air vents. Should check them out. Ooh. Sable nice kid, but what is such a weapons. Whoa. Hammerhead's got sable weapons. That's not good. Uh oh. Oh crap. Dang. Yeah, he's got sable weapons. Shoot him. Where? What? Move, move, move. Ow. Wow. Okay. What the? F and that's it. Gonna be sore tomorrow. Where'd that come from? Time to find Felicia. Wait, who who fired that? Is there one more guy around here? <laughs> I'm so confused. Is there another guy? Felicia? The vault. Yeah, where's the vault? Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. Dang. Tell me you weren't just stringing me along. Sorry, sweetie. But I needed help to pull off a job this big. Wow. All you ever wanted was Hammerhead's drive. The entire wealth of the Magia. In the palm of my hand. You gave Hammerhead wow. fake drives? You think he's going to be mad at me? Yeah. So. <laughs> I think he is. Your son? That was all just a lie? Lie is such an ugly word. I yeah. prefer misdirection. Uh, lie is an ugly word, and what you did was ugly, lady. Oh, man. I earned these. Put a quarter in your butt, Spider-Man. You just got played. Is gonna stop him. If anything, I just helped slow him down a bit. Clean out the whole yard! Check the vault! Oh, crap. I'll raise a glass to you on the Riviera. You? She's gonna actually leave us here for Hammerhead? Well, at least Spider-Man can get out now. Boss, where is it? And? Uh, drive's gone. Uh, no plan. There's a tracker on that drive. Ooh. Find her and kill her. And if she's dumb enough to go to a little penthouse, I've got a crew waiting there to send it sky high. Oh, crap. What about the drives? I don't care about the drives. I just want it. Got it. We'll find her. Don't shut the door. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> if there's a tracker on that drive, Felicia's in trouble. Gotta get to her fast. There is a tracker on that drive, and... Dude, she just sold us out. 
Hammerhead knows where you are, and he's going to kill you. There's a tracker on his drive. I don't get you, Spider. I just calmed the hell out of you, it's and true. here you are trying to save me. That's Peter Parker really is a good nice dude. All the time. It's not about being nice. It's about doing the right thing. You've got so many talents. <laughs> I wish you'd use them to help someone other than yourself. Yeah, well, you should know by now. That's not how I roll. People can change, Felicia. Love you, Spider. I'll miss you. Yikes. He's rigged it to explode. Don't worry. I've still got all nine lives left. Damn it. What? You're not Catwoman Lady? Hang on, Felicia. I'm coming. Does she have does she have nine lives? I feel like that was Catwoman's thing, right? In Batman Returns? Um Come on. Is is it Matt, is it bad that I don't actually want to go to the mission? I want to I want to go find the other uh, paintings <laughs> first. <laughs> yeah, screw it. We'll go to the final mission. Yikes. Come on, Scarlet Spider. You got this. Boom. What? That's the ending? <laughs> oh, man. Well, I guess before we call it the official ending, let's go find those last two paintings. Um, oh, man. All right, to be continued. You got me, game. You got me. Another post credit scene? Wow. And they still haven't found a body? No. Yeah, so she's still out there. I think she survived. I mean, I don't know how, but she could have. Well, anything's possible, but... So, how's it feel to not be a dad? <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> no, no, I'm serious. Honestly, I... Relieved. Peter's gonna make a good dad I one day, though. On yeah, you do. But I think you're gonna be an amazing dad someday. At the right time. <laughs> the right person. These kids are gonna be all right. Um, yeah, I th I think Peter would make a great dad. Um, it's kind of interesting to see. Uh, We'll have to wait for Turf Wars. It comes out next week, so we're not too far away. Um, oh, we unlocked Spider UK. Let's do that while we go hunt down um, the final uh, paintings. Let's uh, let's get that suit on. I kind of like this suit a little bit. Yeah, Spider UK. It looks cool. Oh. Another one, detective. Hardy had enough to set himself up for life. I almost feel sorry for him. Probably for the fact how it shook out. A dead body? A little kid without a father? Trust me, that's never for the best. It is when the Magia has got a crutch. Hardy's death squared things. Yeah, see? Jeff disappeared, the mob never would have stopped gunning for And he was a cop this whole time? state's evidence. Got him witness protection. The Magia has got a long some things you can't come back from. Hey, so according to my records, there's only one more painting missing. I'll let you know when I find it. Yeah. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. It's over that way. Let's go check it out. Let's wrap this bad boy up. I'm glad the last two were near each other. I thought I was going to have to, like, fast travel somewhere else again. But nope. Luckily, we missed two that were right next to each other. Let's end this episode. Let's get this last painting and One of the stolen paintings oh. should be around here somewhere. Hmm. 
There it is, right on top of the church. Party must have stashed something here. Another painting. There we go. It's all ten. Looks like I found the last stash. Any other leads to track down? That's the last piece of art I've I really can't thank you enough, Spider-Man. Glad to help, Detective Mackey. And hey, I think you're right about the new cat. Look out for her, okay? It mean a lot to me. Uh, that was weird. What did he, he mean by that's that? totally her dad. Come on now. Oh. And that's even weirder. Better stop by his precinct. All right, let's go. New side mission unlocked. All right, that's where we're going to go. All right, we're going to his precinct, but uh, I think we're going to find out that he ain't no cop, man. Or maybe he was, or he's pretending to be a cop, I guess. He was up here, right? Um, but again, he was just hanging out on a roof. We don't actually know if he was a real cop. I think he was, and he was hiding in plain sight the whole time. Hey, I'm looking for Detective Mackey. Mackey? Ah, doesn't ring a bell. Older guy with a mustache? <laughs> Either you got the wrong precinct, or someone played you. Yeah, someone played me all right. Ooh. Sergeant Mackey, or do you prefer Walter Hardy? Hey, don't judge me. I did what I had to do. Your daughter thinks you're dead, you know. And let's keep her thinking that, for her sake. Deal. Deal? You just conned me. Why should I do anything for you? Because <laughs> you're a decent guy. Take care of my little girl. Uh, I'm so gullible. <laughs> I need to learn how to be heartless and cynical like everyone else. Oh, man. Yeah, all right, so like a fiddle. That's great. So, yeah, it looks like uh, uh, my theory was right. That was That was her dad. That was still cool. I still enjoyed that. This open window can lead somewhere or nowhere. It's up to you. What do you mean, who is this? It's Chris. Why won't you believe me?